And you know what's crazy? People be judging you for not knowing how to play spades, but they won't teach you how to play spades. Make it make sense. One thing about me is just learning to embrace things that society deems as not beautiful. Not beautiful. she and partner so uh, I uh, pretty often get clothes from them um, so this is my most recent items that I got from them um, and when I say super cute super cute y'all go see um, and I actually have some things that I got from the program and some things I bought on my own because sometimes you see things that it's not offered okay it's not in the what you could get so I had to get this stuff um, and I'll let you know which ones came from the partner versus what I bought with my own money. So we can go ahead and get started. So this is actually the first thing that I got. Um, so this is actually one of the things uh, that they sent me uh, as a partner. C come on, just, just look at the dress. Come on, this is too cute. Like when I saw this on the model, first of all, she it's a long dress. Like let me see if I can stand up on my tippy toes. It's pretty much to my ankles. And she was wearing the wrong shoe in the picture. But I know, <laughs> I know that I'm going to uh, pair this with a really nice heel, probably a clear heel, cause the colors in here is more like an orange, purple, not too much black. So I'll probably do a glass heel with this. It is see-through. Y'all can clearly see that. This is my underwear. Um, so just be mindful of that. now. I'm okay with being sheer. I'm okay with showing just a little bit. I'm still gonna wear, you know, my undergarments, a dark color, of course, um, or something flesh tone, just so that when I'm wearing this, it won't be like, she ain't got no panties on, or, um, you know, just looking crazy. So if you do decide to get this dress, definitely just be aware that it is see-through, and, you know, totally up to you if you wanna go commando free balling. <laughs> I would recommend it, but hey, live your best life, okay? Um, so I definitely get this dress a 10 out of 10, stretchy, I mean like ultimate stretch. And I see that we are still not at the point where we are putting tags in clothes. Like what is going on? The only way that I knew that this was the front was because it is a line going down the back of the dress, which means they just sewed the pieces together in the back. That's the only way I knew that that this was the front. Other way, I otherwise I would have put it on the the wrong way. But anyways, hopefully we get back to putting tags in clothes because I need to know what's the front versus the back. Sometimes I can figure it out. Sometimes I just be like, hey, it is what it is. So yeah. Um, but yeah, definitely a cute dress. I like to do the 360 one more time because I'm feeling it. Um, and yeah, 10 out of 10, and we can go on to our next item. So here I am in the next item. So it is this top and this skirt. So I purposely got this as a set um, because I rarely wear like pieces and I really try to diversify my wardrobe even though I am the queen of dresses because I love a dress. Sometimes your girl needs variety, you know? Um, so this is where my variety may come from. Now, let's start with the top because I thought it was super cute. By the way, this is something that they said to me, both the items. Um, but I thought the shirt was like super cute with the sleeve. It's like gathered here, gathered here. It's a tsunami of like cottage core, <laughs> if I'm even using that right. Um, or, you know, just, just really cute. Uh, period, like off the shoulders. I love off the shoulder because I just feel like that's just like, ooh, we going, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Don't mind me, <laughs> but um, it's just, you know, I just thought it was really cute and I thought that this would be the perfect bottom to go. So even though 
it's not a dress you know it's like a dress without the top sewn on uh so i got this because i thought that a it would match the shirt but b actually i did it the other way i matched this shirt to the to the skirt um but when i saw it i was like oh that's super cute i love graphic like graphic colors a graphic print um so it is about ankle length uh so if you are i'm five seven so I mean, technically a tall girl could get away with this as well because, you know, all skirts don't have to be to our ankles, right? Um, so this is definitely some good good pieces to put together. Now, back to the top. As a member of the Big Titty Committee, I don't know if I approve of this top for my big chest sisters out there. And I'm gonna tell you why. So first of all, if I come closer, this, that's my bra the top is not even covering my bra um and of course it's a strapless bra so my bra is already hanging out at the bottom and then if i try to pull it up this is the top of the top of my bra is right here the bottom is right here and the top stop right there so you know i'm like uh, was they expecting people like maybe this is for braless people people who cannot wear a bra i wasn't really sure so you know i didn't know that the the top where the boob party is would be this small but i guess they were expecting a smaller chested person to be wearing this i guess um but hey we here and it is what it is at this point because i still think the top is really cute now y'all know what i got an issue with my sweet hawaiian rose is singing in the back and i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all Woo! it is singing they are saying hello there uh, but it's not horrible, you know, it's just, I'm still trying to get to the point where I am okay with showing off my little butterfly wings back there. Um, you know, sometimes we got to get over things within ourselves, you know, things that we don't like about ourselves. But guess what? I have never, ever in my life had a man that I was interested in and talking to say, ew, look at your back rows, or ew, look at your hyperpigmentation, or ew, you know, anything. Like, they might say ew because I fart or something, and that takes a while to get to. So I know they didn't say that either. But, um, yeah, I just feel like sometimes we be in our heads, like thinking about, oh, what people think, and just all of that. So I'm really trying to get over that about my back rows and get to the point of where I don't give a fuck, you know, like I'm just comfortable. Um, and even though, like, this is not horrible, like I said, it's still, it's still there, you know? But that's okay. We getting there. I'm getting there. I'm gonna get there with this top because I can't, I can't, like, not wear this, right? Um, so yeah, you know, the, the top, I'm gonna give it a 8 out of 10. And I love the sleeve, love the look, but my, my bra area, like, that's just... That's just not cute having your bra hang out at the bottom. Um, luckily, mine kind of sit, you know, like right on my stomach. So it, it might not be as noticeable, especially because I have a black strapless bra on. Like if this strapless bra was white or my my skin color or something, then it would probably be way more noticeable. So yeah, and then the skirt, honey. You know, I feel like I'm about to go dancing. Um, the skirt gets a 10 out of 10. I mean, it's doing what it's supposed to do. So I'll give y'all the 360 and a little whoop whoop. I'm clearly in the dancing mode. <laughs> but um, but yeah, dress, I mean the skirt 10 out of 10, this 8 out of 10. Overall, I think this is a cute ass outfit and I'm definitely going to wear it. So let's go on to our next item. I got a couple more and then we will be done. All right, so here I am in the next item. So it is this black dress uh, with this like tie lace up detail that goes across and then pops out on the leg y'all already know why i got this okay because it's sexy the, the leg y'all know i love that i love that look on myself um so the dress is really comfortable very stretchy um y'all know i love that because it's just something about like a outfit that doesn't stretch too much it just feels so constricted Ugh, I just don't like that. I just love a stretch, you know? And then, like, my weight fluctuates. So, I need something that can roll with me, you know? Because I ain't going to stay the same size all the time. And that is okay. Um, so, uh, like I said, really comfortable dress. I love this detail right here. And actually, I took it upon myself because it has stopped, like, 
about right here where they had tied it up at. So I actually uh, looped it in the, some other loops just so it wouldn't be as short. Cause I mean, that boy was like that, which totally fine as well. But I wore this to a concert last, uh, last Wednesday. I mean, last Saturday. Man, if you ever been to Shane Park, just know that they disappointed the fuck out of us, okay? I went to go see um, Music Soul Child, and when I say the sound was horrible, like horrible. Anyways, at least I was looking cute though, <laughs> right? So um, this is what I wore, and you know, really cute dress. Um, I paired it with, I actually just wore some lace up sandals because at Shane Park, sometimes you have to do a little bit of walking. Uh, sometimes you gotta park on gravel, like uh, rocks and shit. So I was like, let me not do too much and put a heel on because my first time I fucked up and I wore my thigh high boots and my feet was like that when I was walking across the rocks and shit. So I said, they ain't gonna get me again. You gotta learn from your mistakes, okay? Um, so yes, and actually, while we here, honey, let me go ahead and show y'all these cute ass fucking shoes I bought. Hold on. Don't play. O M G. Yes. Like, I love, love, love these. Oh my goodness. Like, I love uh something that catches your eye, something that's like different, like. You're not gonna see your everyday girl wearing these. That's the type of thing I like. So, and I, one thing I was worried about because if you don't know, I wear a size 11 wide, okay? Because my foot, just imagine me being this big and I got a small ass foot. It happens sometimes, but it's not, it ain't happened with me. Um, so I wear an 11 wide and I was concerned that this part right here might not fit over my foot because it's a wide, right? But they actually do fit over my foot and it is a perfect fit now if I could have went up a half size would have did it I would have um, but I will take the 11 and just give me one sec I can put them on and try to show you it's wizard Kelly y'all <laughs> oh, classic if you ever seen me in the proud family okay I'm gonna try to hold my foot up just so y'all can see Super cute, look at that, oh my goodness. Um, so, listen, I'm tall as fuck right now. <laughs> Clearly you can see, but I, what I usually like to do to test for y'all to show y'all how tall the shoe is. This is me balancing on the shoe. This is me without the shoe. With the shoe, without the shoe. I'm gonna, I love being a towering bitch, clearly because why not, right? Like, foul before me. No, I'm just playing. Um, and actually, um, while we're here, I might as well show you the other pair of shoes I got as well, so give me one second. So here is the other shoe. It is a lace-up, and I love a platform because platform plus a chunky heel, easiest shoes to walk in, I guarantee you. Um, when I first started walking in heels, of course I started with like a smaller heel um, and then I kind of graduated. Now platforms with chunky heels are my favorite find because it gives me stability. Um, I feel like I'm not trying to balance on like that little pinky heel, you know, like that. Yeah, I can't do that. Uh, so that's the shoes I got and I got those shoes with my own money, okay? Because I was like, listen, I gotta have these. Like I gotta add them to my closet. Um, so I got one more dress to show y'all and then we gonna be done. All right, so here I am in my last and final item. So this is a more so like a maxi summer flowy dress um, that they also sent to me. Uh, so I already have this dress in like a pink. If you watch like a, I think about two Shein videos ago, I had the like pink and blue version of this dress, which I loved. So what I always say, if you get something in it more than once, then you really like that dress. <laughs> so I really like this dress. Um, although I have not worn it anywhere yet, I do plan on wearing it somewhere where maybe, you know, like my mom isn't around. Or something. <laughs> Cause I already know she would say something. But um, anyways, 
very cute like the only thing for my girls who you know may not like this that's the only thing um so what i do like is that it has adjustable straps so that is how my boobs kind of look snug and secure in this cup right now because at first they was not looking good so if you do get this dress it you know you can tighten your straps which will give you a nice lift um so yeah can i give y'all the 360 three give a twirl <laughs> but uh yes and this dress is floor length on me like i said i'm five seven so i think this was a pretty successful haul i got everything that i liked like everything was good in my opinion oh yeah by the way this dress i'm gonna give shoes both 10 out of 10 i'm gonna give this dress also a 10 out of 10 well nine and a half only because i just wish that was just like a little bit just like that, you know, just so girls don't have to be like, oh, all the way out there, you know? But still think everything in this haul was really good, um, personal opinion. Let me know what y'all think. Y'all could be like, no, you tripping, all that stuff was ugly, which I hope y'all don't say that, because <laughs> that means you don't like my style, no? <laughs> but no, um, I appreciate you for watching this video um definitely let me know if you have any questions just let, let me know anything in the comments follow me on instagram at i am chrissy um follow my uh, podcast page think twice podcast and check us out that link is also going to be in the description as uh along with all of my sizes and links to so all of this stuff so thank y'all once again and i'll see y'all next time <laughs>